No, 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 no. Say Savage, stay Savage, your boy Sino Ventro was popping today. We are back, and a lot of you guys' dreams, answers have finally been, uh, you know, brought into light because we're finally starting to get the Boruto Naruto Next Generation dub. Yes, it has been confirmed that Boruto Naruto Next Generation dub will be on Toonami starting September 29th, 2018. I know a lot of you guys always ask me time and time again, hey, what's up? When can I actually check out the Boruto English dub? But guess what, guys? It's coming soon. My only concern is with this is like all right so for me personally i played uh naruto ultimate Ninja storm 4 and i know a lot of you guys have and we all got to see the road to boruto edition which was the expansion pad dlc you know obviously we got a new character from the generation we got mitsuki boruto sarada we got to play as hokage naruto as well as sasuke we got to see hinata the last well hinata in her mommy form kind of and then we also got to see sakura in her older age but the thing with that is is like you know when we heard boruto initially boruto was very like just uh, like just overwhelming his voice was very like just annoying like I couldn't deal with it for the most part and I would rather actually listen to it and sub now me personally I'm not a big sub or dub fan it's more so whatever I can watch anime in because you know I've been growing up and growing up in a time where we didn't have all these different websites where you can just get on it and watch a lot of different anime it was kind of one of those things where you watch what you got when you got it and you just let it be you know what I'm saying so I watch it in dub, I watch it in sub, whatever comes first, you know, whatever, you know, it's more comfortable. And a lot of the times, you know, I can pull off a dub because, you know, I can actually do something else while like watching it. I could like maybe edit a video or I can multitask some things versus like a sub, I always have to pay attention to it. I mean, at this point in time, I kind of know some of the stuff that they're saying, you know, so I don't necessarily have to look at it all the time. Like if I hear Daijobu, I hear Baka, I hear Ikzo, you know, obviously that means let's go or idiot or stuff like that. You know, we kind of get an idea or a gist of what's going down. But for the most part, you know, when watching a dub, it's a lot easier, it's a lot smoother because when you're watching it, you can kind of just do whatever, you know, you don't have to actually like read the subtitles the whole entire time. So, you know, me personally, I think it's going to be really dope to see Boruto finally get like that recognition into like the dub spotlight. You know, a lot of people have been wondering when Boruto was coming to that. The biggest question in the comment section is be, where can I watch Boruto in English? I did make a video talking about it. Will we ever get one? And now we're getting it, we're getting it in the same year, the same year that I made the video asking about the Boruto dub. This because you know a lot of times we didn't get to see the the naruto shippuden dub and i didn't realize that it was actually still ongoing i did know they took like this big old hiatus when they had this like licensing issue between uh disney xd and then switching it over to cartoon network because obviously it did like a double flip you know and you know they did a lot of censorship and people was not for it but now that it's finally coming to toonami we're going to get the proper dub that we deserve and also i remember the last time we talked about this a lot of you guys were letting me know that you know the boruto series was eventually going to get an english dub because that it was having a continuation of naruto shippuden dub over on toonami which i really didn't know as a person who don't necessarily watch tv i don't usually know what's going on with it like for me i watch a lot of anime you know obviously i have a lot of sites for that i use crunchyroll master anime like stuff like that you know obviously i always peep things from a uh, online perspective or i might just watch something on netflix which i rarely ever do you know i used to watch netflix a lot but i don't really watch tv so for the most part i didn't know naruto shippuden was actually airing again on toonami which was really great and i think that this is going to help the series a lot because now that it, boruto is going to get an english dub i feel like more people are going to be more in tune with it more, more people are going to get engaged with it because in the beginning you know once you're limited you're, yourself to just having sub and not having like a dub you know you re you can't reach it like the masses you know there's like those people that only watch anime and dub you know and now they just get bored to more viewership more traction and stuff like that and i feel as though it can actually help the community for board to grow a little bit more and, you know get a little bit more defined and so outside of that you know i'm just overall excited to see what's to come i'm waiting to see how this will impact the audiences and shit like that like you know everybody's gonna have their personal thoughts and personal opinions you know i might like the way something sounds or i might not like the way something sounds and you might like the way something sounds and i might not like that or you know vice versa it's just gonna be that way but as of my first like impressions of borto being dubbed you know obviously Obviously, I seen the Boruto movie, which had a dub, and I seen the Boruto, you know, Road to Boruto for Naruto Shinobi. Uh, I'm about to say Naruto the Shinobi Strikers. That game is trash, but I uh, for Nar <laughs> Naruto Ultimate Ninja Star before, you know, I seen the dubs for those. So like, I wasn't really impressed by Boruto's voice. He was kind of kind of sounding really whiny, but at the same time, I understand why he's sounding like that because he's a kid. But like, even still, it was one of those things where it was like, yo. I don't know if I can bear with this, you know. It's kind of like when you first get introduced to Asta of Black Clover. It's a lot of screaming 
mean there's a lot to take in at once so you don't know necessarily what you want to do with the series or if you want to keep watching it or not so you know you usually just kind of get straight away for certain things like that so me personally i'm looking forward to it i will cover the dub and the sub you know obviously i'm gonna give you guys my personal thoughts and personal opinions on how things sound in the dub you know i'm gonna let you guys know how i feel about it and i'm gonna actually do a lot of comparisons to the sub because you guys know a lot of the times translations actually get switched around you know a lot of different words are usually get changed up and shit like that so you won't necessarily see the initial statements that they made from the sub to the dub so you know you'll see things start to fluctuate and i'll try to point out those things but outside of that you know these are my personal thoughts and my personal opinions if you have your own personal thoughts and personal opinions regarding uh, Boruto so actually getting a dub let me know how you feel about that in the comment section below let me know your personal thoughts and personal opinions as always you know i'll share mine i always do actually in the video and with that being said make sure you hit that like button if you're new to the channel subscribe for daily content with that being said finally my name is shino Ventro. stay tuned stay around i hope you guys have a blessed day and until next time see you guys later bye -bye.